have been walking in the same way as I did. Missing out the cracks in the pavement and tutting my heel and strutting my feet. Is there anything I can do for you, dear? Is there anyone I could call? No one, thank you, please, madame. I ain't lost, just wondering. From my hometown, may I like it in the city when the air is so thick and opaque. I love her to see everybody in short skirts, shorts, and shades. I like it in the city when two. Shows that we ain't gonna stand shit. Shows that we are united. Shows that we ain't gonna take it. Shows that we ain't gonna stand shit. Shows that we are united. From my hometown, May memories are fresh. Ladies and gentlemen, 40 years ago, the entire sports universe was tuned in to Madison Square Garden, New York City. The event was known as the Battle of Champions. In the golden age of heavyweights, two champions, each with a claim to the title and undefeated records, rose to the top and faced each other that night. In one corner, Muhammad Ali. In the other corner, 100, pardon me, 206 pounds of chiseled ebony steel. The son of a South Carolina sharecropper who fought his way to an Olympic gold medal and then to the hot hop of the heavyweight division. On that night, only one man left the ring after 15 rounds. He was undisputed, the undefeated heavyweight champion of the world. His name, Smokin' Joe Frazier. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of Nevada Governor Brian Sandoval and the Nevada State Athletic Commission, HBO Sports, and Bob Arum's Top Rank Boxing, please rise at this time as we toll a memorial count of 10 and say farewell to beloved Joe Frazier.
Rest in peace, champion. Rest in peace.